We are getting many emails. What is the status about the parts for 790? So good news is uh, we have started working on it already. Yeah, there are already some parts uh, you can already purchase uh, in our eShop. Uh, lower and larger food packs. Uh, Second thing, what we have produced: the reinforced uh, carbon and Kevlar uh, tank protectors. They fit with the original skid plate, uh, looks better and for sure they are more uh, more hard than the plastic originals. The third thing we have already available uh, is a ready style exhaust pipe. You see we kicked out the canister, the original goes like this, we don't like the design of the original, so we kick it out and we put the ready style pipe here. You don't see it because we are getting now to the uh, to the part that is in uh, testing mode. Yeah, and these are the panniers racks. We designed the panniers racks a little bit differently than the others because we have moved them a little bit to the front and low. So even you put there something heavy, you still have pretty good center of gravity uh, with your bike. Hey guys, last but not least, uh, the windscreen. Uh, we decided. We will do first the windscreen that will fit with the original headlight. Actually, the LEDs are already there, so no need to replace them. We will just uh, design a new windscreen with uh, with the small uh, deflectors on the sides. Yeah, and as it will fit with the original headlights, so the price will be very competitive. Get me right, we won't reuse the windscreen from 1090. We will design a completely new one that will fit perfectly with the 790. Yeah. And if you are curious how will be more or less the final look, you can check our website where are already the sketches and you can subscribe your email and you will get as the first uh, uh, the, the updates uh, how we are progressing on uh, production of the 790 windscreen. Of course, you are getting more space for navigation here yeah, when you put the windscreen like this. You can see here already something, something that is not produced by us, but we got one piece to test it and to use it. And we have been testing a new navigation, something that I personally haven't seen before. Uh, it's a, a base of your tablet, but you can see okay, that what we have okay, up there is actually okay, a roadbook. So uh, the, the device okay, is mounted okay, inside okay, the cockpit. Uh, it allows you to switch okay, between race mode okay, with, with, with a roadbook and regular navigation okay, using Locus Map. Uh, but not only okay, it has okay, the traditional touchscreen uh, navigation, there is a remote okay, control mounted okay, to the handlebars that within the Locus Map allows you to zoom in, zoom out, move okay, the, 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 cor the cursor. It's a first okay, version, right, okay, it's going to take okay, for a week okay, of testing okay, up okay, in uh, Norway. And then we are going to give you okay, another update on okay, how it went.